These refugees are back home in Afghanistan. Their life in neighboring Iran came to a standstill when the new coronavirus spread across the country. With no jobs and a growing pandemic, they decided to leave. My friends and I, we all came back to Afghanistan. We left even though we were still old months worth of unpaid salary. The situation is very serious there. I saw with my own eyes how people were buried in mass graves. About three million Afghan refugees live in Iran. Health leaders now fear many of them could be bringing the virus back with them. When refugees started to come back in late February, we had about 1,300 people every day. Just yesterday, we had over 13,000 people. We estimate that around 90,000 people have returned to Afghanistan voluntarily. The biggest cluster of infections has been recorded in the western province of Herat, which shares a border with Iran. Many refugees returned unchecked, raising panic in nearby communities and reports emerged of infected patients fleeing hospitals. They're coming back in a rush and under chaotic circumstances. Those who are infected with the virus will definitely contaminate their friends. It's a really serious issue for the Ministry of Public Health. To try and limit infections, clinics have been set up along the border. Staff is checking temperatures and teaching groups just how easily the virus spreads. Fortunately, we increased our staff. We are registering people depending on their provinces now. We have temperature guns and we will install a scanner to check them. But with thousands of people returning from Iran, health officials fear this pandemic will spread further into Afghanistan. Katia Lopez-Odoyan, Al Jazeera.